What's up guys, Andrew here at My Channel Gear Inc. where I get to share what I'm passionate about with you. And on my channel, that's PC Tech, Games, and Gear. Sorry for the echo. If you guys can't notice, I'm finally in my basement. I've been working on this studio space for the last, well, for months and months, but finally got the majority of it done. So here's kind of a quick peek around what the room looks like. I think it came out absolutely great and there's gonna be things added. So this is gonna be like my studio man did. I apologize if there's any echo right now. Obviously there's nothing to absorb the sound and I'm gonna try and uh, edit this as best I can, but if there's a little bit of echo, bear with with me. So the topic today, very, very exciting, NVIDIA. Now, obviously we just had the keynote with uh, Jensen, you know, at SIGGRAPH going over um, all the different technologies. We got confirmation of at least one new architecture from NVIDIA, which is Turing. Now, this appears to be their upgrade to their Quadro or um, G basically GPU architecture that they use for things like 3D animation, you know, think Pixar, uh, that kind of thing. It's not a gamer type car but it was nice to see. We see uh, basically the different sizes and dies, some of the new technologies that they're adding to the uh, basically architecture itself. I'm not gonna go over all the talking points in this video. I wanna kinda keep this short and concise, but I am gonna link the video down below if you wanna watch the whole thing. And then AND Tech actually did a great um, kind of breakdown of it as well, so I'll link that too. But I mean, it's cool to see they're talking about six times the performance of Pascal, which I thought was a little bit of a cop out simply from the fact that uh, Pascal didn't have a lot of these technologies like tensor cores and things like that so it's not necessarily a fair comparison but when you're comparing it against something like Volta it makes a little more sense um, even though I don't know if it's necessarily six times the performance overall um, you know for me uh, kind of being a self-taught guy I understand a lot of the, the technology but obviously there's some of the stuff that still goes over my head so it's one of those things where I was looking through it and kind of doing my own research but it's still cool to see that we finally have confirmation of something something coming out why I wholeheartedly believe that all this stuff aside, we're gonna see the RTX or you know these are included in the RTX or ray tracing technology GPUs we're gonna see the next variant for the either GTX or RTX gaming GPUs was this tiny little thing that they released on Twitter right after so they released this video that appears to be a teaser of the next gen gaming GPUs. We get to see basically all these different builders kind of tinkering with it. Um, from the design of this, it looks like this might be an open uh, face cooler, which would be different from their closing, you know, basically their enclosed shroud they've had for basically all their GPUs for like six, seven years. I don't even know if they have ever not done that, but it gives it like a little teaser and then it says, um, basically the date which we've come to believe, which is gonna be GamesCon, so they'll be announcing these GPUs. Now, if they don't announce at a GamesCon, I'm gonna be incredibly let down and a little bit sad. Ultimately, I think that we're gonna finally see these GPUs come out. So anyway, guys, I've linked all this stuff down below. Check it all out. I'm super excited. I can't wait for this stuff to drop. But guys, as always, thank you to all my Patreons and Twitch subs. Remember that if you are a Twitch subscriber or a Patreon, I put your name at the end of my videos. It's a big way to say thank you, but big shout out to you guys. Remember to use my Amazon affiliate link, which is down below if you're buying anything through Amazon, guys. That does uh, help me directly as well. But outside of that, guys, Thank you to all of you. This has been a great year for me and my channel. Um, thank you so much for everyone who continues to support me. And remember, I'm gonna make these videos whether you watch them or not, but I hope you do, and I hope to see all of you next time here on Gear Inc.